Welcome everyone to my show, Bringing Back the Dead. Today we are going to be interviewing a very important person who has discovered many bodies of water. None other than Mr. Henry Hudson! Give him a round of applause! Go Henry! Go Henry! Go Henry! It's your birthday! It's your birthday! It's your birthday! Thank you, thank you very much, and thank you, Stephanie, for bringing me back from the dead. You're very welcome, Henry. Okay, let's get started in the interview. Where and when were you born? I was born in England in the 1500s when I was just a little sprout growing into a beautiful flower. Okay, then. So tell me, why are you are mostly famous? I'm famous for the discovery of the Hudson River, Hudson Bay, and Hudson Strait. Okay, when was your for first voyage to Hudson? In 1607, I was hired by the Muscovy Company to find a faster route to the Orient. I sailed the north, northern pass, Iceland, reaching the eastern coast of Greenland. In June, I reached the that's foul board island. Sorry, that's very hard to pronounce. In the Arctic Ocean, unfortunately, I did not find a faster route to the Orient. Oh, I'm so sorry. When was your second voyage? It was in 1608. I took another voyage on the Hope while still trying to fast find a faster route to the Orient. This time, I decided to go through the northern path part of Russia and the eastern part of the North Pole. The Hope will also pass by the northern part of Norway and the Barnard Sea. Sadly, I still failed to find a faster route to the Orient. Oh, so sorry. When was your third voyage? In 1609, I set sail from Amsterdam on a ship called the Half Moon for my third voyage. The ice and cold weather blocked my ship and we had to turn around. Instead of returning home, I went to North America. I believe there was a river that went from the Atlantic to Pacific Ocean. The half moon headed west in search of this river. The, the crew wanted to go home. A few months later, the half moon reached America on the coast of Maine. I kept looking for the river. We started to go south along the coast. Later on, the crew and I arrived in New York. This is when I began, began my fo mo most famous trip ever. This is when I sailed the Hudson River. And now, how about your fourth voyage? In 1610, I set sail from England. This time I was aboard a ship called the Discovery. Aboard the Discovery, I, I sailed once again to North America. This time I discovered the Hudson Strait. This journey was dangerous. The adventure to the Hudson was called the Furious Overfall. It had rushing tides, whirlpools, and other obstacles. In addition, the crew aboard the Discovery was low on food. The Discovery entered what is now called the Hudson Bay. So, how did you die? In 1611, the crew of the Discovery before immunity and abandoned me, my son and, my, and some loyal other men. I was left in a rowboat in the middle of the sea, and I was never heard from again. Until my good friend Stephanie called and invited me up, and here I am, everyone. Here I am. Okay. That's all, folks. I hope you enjoyed my show. Next, we'll bring back my cousin's grandma. So turn, tune in next week. Thank you, everyone, and thank you, Henry. No, thank you. Bye-bye, everyone. Good day now. Me, the producer of the show. If he could do a little rap, so I said, okay, so here he is. Okay, everyone, give him a round of applause. <laughs> Hit it. My name is Henry Hudson. I was born in the 1500s and I died in 1611. My crew caused immunity and. My crew caused immunity, immunity, uh, uh, immunity, and threw me off the ship. It's a mutiny. Sorry. A mutiny, a mutiny, a, uh, 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 a mutiny. And threw me off the ship with my son John, or is it?